people, this is Patches and Megan from Mischievous Monsters. Today I'm going to show you how to make five vegan Christmas baskets. Let's get started. I have a big and a small basket because you know how people don't always want the big baskets when they live by themselves like me. We're going to start off with the fruit basket. When you do the fruit basket, you want to try to not have too fragile of fruit like berries. Um, have things that can be out for a while, like the things that are out for store. Got a couple different types of apples, grapefruit, oranges, kiwi, and bananas. Make sure you have tissue paper underneath so it actually looks nice. These baskets and tissue paper from Hobby Lobby. Number one, you get your basket and then put your tissue paper in. Make it look slightly messy. This took three tissue papers. Next, you just pick what fruit you want in the basket. So we got some Fuji and Granny Smith apples on the bottom. Next, you make the basket go up to the top. Orange are more fragile, so you want to add the citrus closer to the top. What, honey? This is just one tissue paper. And pretend the cat's not there. Eight apples in here, four granny fizz, four Fuji, and a one thing of nuts. Some things I'm gonna put into the hot chocolate baskets are a couple of mugs. These are from Target. The hot chocolate of choice is Swiss Miss Dairy Free Chocolate, which is a vegan. And if I'm wrong, tell me in the comments. And then we need some toppings for the hot chocolate and stuff. So I got some Yum Earth candy canes. We got this uh, biscuits, vegan sprinkles, Enjoy Life mini chocolate chip, and some Dandy's vegan marshmallows. Ta da! Two candy canes, two things of this stuff biscuits or cookies, two hot chocolates, one on the edge. Same thing with the other. Then we got a whole thing of candy marshmallows. We'll add both of the sprinkles that I got in the front. Put them in this corner. Normally I'd add a lot more hot chocolate, but I don't have, only have those right now. Fill the rest of those up, we're going to add a couple of things to enjoy like cookies. There you go. My third Christmas basket is a Santa Claus. It's a vegan Santa basket. So most of what's here is cookies and milk. Sure, if you want to make it special, have some bins for your treats. This sand isn't as hungry, so I'm gonna put two individual soy milks in here. Since I didn't have a big enough thing for a tin, I just put a box of cookies in there, some hot chocolate, two candy canes. So this sand will be very happy. Let's make the big basket now. Honey, um, I'm not giving you away. Okay. We got this whole thing of cookies that um, Patches wants to choose what they are. Here's my vegan cookie jar. There are five boxes of pre-made cookies in here. For, two from Partake and three from Enjoy Life. I'm gonna add some candy canes. Hot chocolate in the front. I need marshmallows in a mug, right? Here's what it looks like when it's done. Our next Christmas basket is the Elf on the Shelf basket. The Elf on the Shelf found all the candy and sweets in your house and put it together and put it in a basket. That's what this is. First, you get your Elf 
Elf on the Shelf. You gotta find a spot in your place for Elf on the Shelf in your basket after you get the wrapping in. Make them obvious and put whatever sweets and goodies you want your kids or family to eat. There you go. So let's get the big one started. Take the cookie jar that we used earlier. Now that's part of this basket. But don't put it in the middle this time because it's not the center of attention. Or open the shelf to center of attention. This will have our candies in it. And we'll separate it. You know how some kids like to separate by Ziploc bags. We've got some vegan licorice, Wiley Wallaby. Put the mug. Your spot, the corner, and games on the outside. Hot chocolate, the hot chocolate thing. Marshmallow. Chocolate chips. More marshmallows and your sprinkles. There you go, it's done. Last vegan Christmas basket I have for you is a movie night basket. So you can add a gift card to this too, if you want, but I didn't feel like buying a gift card just for this display. You remember your popcorn? I like Skinny Pop popcorn, it's certified vegan. And then what other, whatever other snacks people like in movies. So we got your fruit snacks and then some of your toppings. You got raisins and I'll eventually get chocolate chips and then we got hot chocolate going on again and this is for like if you're like me you live by yourself besides your cat this can be your basket for you you have one hot chocolate mug and a couple hot chocolate mixes don't forget your candy at least two candy canes two peanut butter plum popcorn biscuits and a couple fruit snacks Ta -da. Let's do the big basket now. If you want to get a popcorn tin, just get the large reusable one from the movie and then just bring it home. Put it in the back. Then put all your popcorn in it. Then we got a few toppings. Raisins. Chocolate chips. Marshmallows. Make sure you have candy canes in here. Throw your whole thing of vegan fruit snacks in here. Put some biscuits in here. You can add some cookies in here, but if I had to choose between popcorn and cookies at a movie, I'd pick popcorn any day. There we go. Thanks for watching. If you had a favorite vegan Christmas basket, put it in the comments. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you soon.